Texas church shooting, two fatally shot before gunman killed by churchgoer. A still from a live stream shows the gunman, in black, producing a gun, before opening fire. And in this app photo from live streamed video provided by law enforcement, churchgoers take cover while a congregant armed with a handgun, top left, engages a man who opened fire, near top center just right of windows, during a service at West Freeway Church of Christ, Sunday December 29, 2019, in White Settlement, Texas. The shooting happened during the morning service at West Freeway Church of Christ. The footage was broadcast online by the church according to a law enforcement official, who provided the image to the Associated Press on condition on anonymity because the investigation is ongoing. The shooting happened during the morning service at West Freeway Church of Christ. Shocked worshippers were evacuated from the church. News script from BBC. A gunman opened fire in a church in Texas, fatally shooting two parishioners before being killed by an armed member of the congregation. The gunman stood up from a pew at West Freeway Church of Christ in White Settlement, a suburb of Fort Worth, pulled out a shotgun and begun firing. All clips may not represent the story. Police said they were still trying to determine the attacker's motives. White Settlement Police Chief J.P. Beavering praised the heroic actions of those who confronted the attacker. The shooting took place at about 11.50, 17.50 Greenwich Mean Time, during the morning service. The service was being live-streamed on social media. Watch to become bilingual with latest world news. Video footage showed the gunman stand up from a pew and speak to a man nearby, who gestured at another parishioner. The gunman then fired at the man he gestured toward. The gunman fired again, at the man he had spoken to, before a member of the congregation acting as a security guard returned fire with a handgun, immediately felling the attacker. Several other parishioners also produced handguns and trained them on the attacker. It was not clear from the video footage whether any of the other armed parishioners fired shots. The two churchgoers who were shot died later in hospital, police said. Members of the congregation in the nearly full church were seen on the live stream ducking down behind pews as screaming filled the room. Jack Cummings, a minister at the church, told the New York Times that the gunman had been acting suspiciously and drew the attention of the church's security team. The security team is made up of volunteers from the church's membership who are licensed to carry firearms. They saved a lot of lives today because this thing would have been a massacre otherwise, Mr. Cummings said. Texas Governor Greg Abbott called the shooting, an evil act of violence. Places of worship are meant to be sacred, and I am grateful for the church members who acted quickly to take down the shooter and help prevent further loss of life, he said in a statement. Witness Isabella Rayola told local broadcaster CBS DFW, it was the most scariest thing. You feel like your life is flashing before you. I was so worried about my little one. In September, a new law came into effect in Texas that allowed licensed handgun owners to carry weapons in places of worship. The state has seen a number of deadly shootings this year. In August, 22 people died and 24 were wounded at a Walmart store in El Paso. The same month a gunman killed 7 and wounded 20 at Odessa Midland. In 2017, 26 people were killed when a gunman opened fire at a Baptist church in Sutherland Springs, Texas, during a Sunday service. Please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.